So in this video, I'm going to share with you exactly how to write effective copy within your emails so that you get more conversions and more sales. And in this video, we are going to go over six specific ChatGPT prompts that help you to do just that. And make sure you stick around to the end because I will give you exactly the prompts that we go over in this video for free. All right, so let's get right into it. So the first one is writing enticing subject lines. The subject line is the first thing that people see when they open their email. And it has to be, uh, it has to evoke some kind of curiosity. It has to get them emotional about opening the email. All right. So the prompt is this, write an engaging email subject line for, for an email promoting insert your product or your service. Okay. So for this example, we're going to be promoting a new computer coding online course and we want a subject line for it. All right. So the subject line is this, unlock the secrets of coding excellence. Join our revolutionary online course today. Okay, so again, this is a promotional email subject line. This isn't like an informational email subject line where you are just you know, giving tips or tricks about coding. You are literally putting an offer in front of them, okay? So if you don't like this one, you could simply tell ChatGPT, chat right? Four more and choose from those different ones what you like best or even A-B test them what's going to uh, get the best open rate for you and your audience. Okay. Number two is email openers. This will be the first thing that once people see the subject line, they open the email. This will be like the first line that people see and it has to, it has to captivate them. It has to be attention grabbing and get people to want to continue reading on. So the prompt is this, create an attention grabbing opener for an email introducing insert your product or your service. So the example we're using is for a personalized meal plan service. Okay. So let's see what it spits out. And again, this is the email opener. This will be the first line that uh, people see within your email. All right, didn't work. Let's try again. <laughs> Regenerate. All right, revolutionize your relationship with food. Introduce, introducing your personalized meal plan journey. Okay, so that'll be the first line of the email. Again, if you don't like that, you want something a little different, write five more. Simple as that, and you could choose from there and build your emails based on that. All right, while that thinks, let's go over to the third one, which is writing persuasive email body content. This is where you get into the meat and potatoes of the actual email. So it needs to be persuasive. It has to get people to want to take action, right? So the prompt is this, write a persuasive email, bo email body promoting the unique benefits of insert your product or service, okay? So the example we're using is for uh, eco-friendly, eco-friendly cleaning products line, all right? So in this email, we are telling readers exactly what the unique benefits of it, what is different from the competitors and what they are gonna get out of it, what the benefits are, not what the features are, right? People don't care about the features as much as they care about the benefits because the benefits is what sells people, what gets people to actually put in their credit card information and purchase from you, all right? And then these were the other, uh, openers that is spit out. And like I said before, choose from whichever one you like and build your emails based off of that, All right? So here is the email body that's actually promoting the product, okay? So it's gonna go and talk about the benefits of it. Uncompromising effectiveness, the health and safety of it, right? The benefit of it, the sustainability at its core, versatility and convenience of these eco-friendly cleaning products and join a community con committed to change, all right? And then it gives uh, a nice little call to action down here. Use a code to buy for a 10% discount and then from you, warm regards, okay? Very easy, very simple. Number four is creating engaging calls to action. All right, so the email that this just spit out before, this is a call to action, right? Make a conscious choice today and experience the transformative power of our eco-friendly products. But we might want a different call to action because a call to action is what guides people, what pushes people and says, hey, this is the next step that you need to take in order to experience the benefits that I'm sharing with you, that I'm telling you about, all right? So the prompt is this, create a call to action for an email promoting, insert your product or service that encourages immediate action, okay? So the example we are using is for uh, an online language learning course. So we want to tell, we want to come up with a call to action and give them a limited time discount on that, all right? Just like it did before in this email that is spit out. So 
Uh, here it is. Claim your linguistic adventure now and save 20% on our online language courses. Don't miss out on this exclusive offer. Enroll today and embark on a transformative journey to fluency. Limited time only. Use, co use code language20 at checkout. Perfect. Easy. Right to the point. All right. And it gives people incentive to actually buy, right? Because you could be explaining the benefits of it, what they're going to get out of it, but they, they might love it. It might sound great to them, but they might be distracted, right? How many people are online today and they're just distracted constantly? There's so much going on in this world, in our lives, that you need to give someone an incentive to take action. Okay. And that's where that 20% discount will help. All right. Number five is post purchase follow up emails. So we want to. We want to have a good relationship with our customers because hint, hint, then when we have a good relationship with them, we could sell them again. We can sell more stuff to them. So you want to incorporate post-purchase follow-up emails with the first product that they buy from you. All right. So the prompt is this, create a post-purchase follow-up email for a customer who has just bought, insert your product or service. All right, so in this example, we're gonna be creating a post-purchase follow-up for someone that just bought a high-end photography drone. All right, we wanna let them know that we're here to help them. Do they have any questions? Uh, you know, how can we best serve them, okay? And that goes a long way because what I noticed today, customer service and just the, the interaction with companies has gone downhill significantly. I can't even walk into a Walmart just without being disappointed in the customer service itself. So this goes a long way with people and people remember you, they recommend you, and they're more likely to buy from you over and over again, right? So here it is, subject line, congratulations on your new high-end photography drone. How simple is that, right? Uh, to make your journey as smooth as possible, we put together, put together some essential tips and resources to help you get started. All right, read the manual, charging and battery care, practice flight in open spaces, master the camera setting and join our community. Really simple, really easy, and it just gets people uh, feeling better about their purchase. It, it doesn't lead to you know buyer's remorse, um, especially if you're spending an obscene amount of money on a uh, drone because those things are expensive, all right? And number six is a promotional email for sales or for events, okay? So you want promotional emails. We talked about this in the first uh, email subject line, there's a little bit of a difference between promotional emails and informational emails. But in this specific uh, example, we are just there to present an offer. We aren't there to tell them tips and tricks. We are simply there to make sales. Okay, so the prompt is this, write an email to promote an upcoming flash sale of insert your product or service. So the example is for handmade leather boots, All right? So let's write an email that you know maybe once every quarter we send out a flash sale just to ramp at, ramp up sales a little more okay so here it is limited time offer handcrafted leather boots at an unbeatable price and then here's what they're going to get out of it what makes us stand out from the rest unparalleled unparalleled quality classic elegance customizable comfort sustainable and ethical and then a call to action with the limited time opportunity to purchase from you all right, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful for you. I will leave all of these prompts in the description below for you to literally start using them today. Just insert your business, insert your product or your service and start using them today. Start getting the outputs that you desire. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful for you. If you did like it, you're gonna like the videos at the top here. So make sure to check them out. Make sure to subscribe, leave a like, leave a comment and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.